let's go to Barnes & Noble and see what they have. Welcome to my Barnes & Noble. I'm excited to take y'all on this mini trip and just show you what my Barnes & Noble have. It's not really that exciting, but let's check it out anyways. So when you first walk in, you see this table, which I thought was pretty shocking because you usually see a whole table of Colleen Hoover's, but not today. Did I say Colleen Hoover's? I meant Colleen Hoover. So this table is supposed to be books for the soul, so you have like Romeo and Juliet, a lot of classics, but then there's also Normal People, which is like a sadder book, but it's also modern. So I'm not sure what this collection of table is supposed to be, but I feel like it's just sad. We have Icebreaker because it was just picked up traditionally, and I thought this banner was really interesting because it looks like it was like an Instagram picture that someone made, and if you made this, let my Barnes & Noble know because they took your Instagram post, and if they didn't give you credit, you need to, I don't know, take it back because they're using it. I'm a little disappointed in my Barnes & Noble because they have moved the Read With Pride table into this end shelf, which is very lacking. Like there was only a few books on there and it, it deserved its own table. And this is what I mean. I'll show you the sign, but they took the sign, they just put it on the end of a shelf when it's usually like its own table. So I feel like that's very unfair. And now I'm shopping in the YA section and they still have like pride books around the store. They just don't have a bigger table like they used to. And I really wanted to get this book and I've heard amazing thing. I heard it's like the bachelor, the bachelorette theme, but two contestants fall in love with each other instead. And that's like really cool. And I'm so excited for it, but I decided to pass because I feel like my TBR is very, very long. Then I appreciated this pink aisle, pink theme of like rom-coms. I got an arc of Highly Suspicious and Unfairly Cute by Talia Hibbert and it was the cutest book ever. I adore it so much. I gave it four stars and it's so good. You should definitely read it. I saw this new book called Love and Dance and Egg Rolls and I've never heard it before so I decided to pick it up and check it out but it's definitely so cool. I just like have never heard it before and I haven't heard any like promo, anything on book talk and like bookstagram so I was just like shocked and then I opened it and I saw that it was signed by the author. I genuinely love the YA section so much. I feel like YA does an amazing job with book covers that adult books just don't have, in my opinion. Like the colors, the art, it's just something that's lacking in adult books that YA just has that's really special. I feel like in every single aspect, YA books will always win. Like the cutest books, YA. The coolest books, YA. The most intricate design, YA. Like some of the fantasy designs for YA books, I've never seen like a YA book so detailed. And some adult like fantasy books, like I've seen some boring ones. But as I was shopping, I kept on looking for the buy one, get one 50% off, but they hid it in like the way back of the store. So when I finally found it, I was like, thank goodness, because I was so confused. And then here's my bag, like tugging on the book, almost dropping it. So I had to judge the book talk table. And of course, it's just like every single time the same. I've heard that book was really good, but I just can't understand why they put fake stickers on there. It's like, what happened to real stickers that we could scrape off? I mean, we complain about it all the time, but at least we can take it off. So now we're in adult romances. Then I saw Hunting Adeline, which I know is a dark romance. I thought about reading this, but I decided not to. But I saw it at Barnes & Noble and I didn't realize like how thick it was in person. I knew it was like a 600 page book, but it's really thick. But as I was shopping in person, there were two other people next to me and one of them was recommending their friend Priest by Sierra Simone and they were like, oh, this is really good. You should read it. And they read the back and they were like, oh, that sounds really good. I think I'm going to get it. And they were like, yeah, it's really good. And they continue shopping and I was just recording, kind of minding my own business and they saw me recording and I kind of like don't care. I record in public. It's just kind of like whatever. I mean, like, what are they going to do? Like follow me on TikTok, like subscribe to my YouTube. Also, I read this book in February and it was really cute. I gave it four stars. I think it's like your typical rom-com and it was adorable. Anyways, they also went into like a full conversation of like spicy books and like smutty romances. And I just thought like, wow, they're shameless just like me. And I kind of love that. 
Normalize book talkers, booktubers, bookstagrammer out in the wild doing their own thing. Just normalize book conversation. Normalize spicy romance readers. Don't be embarrassed to shop in the spicy book talk section at Barnes & Noble. Don't be embarrassed to record it because out there, there are two other shoppers also having bold conversations just like you. But also out there, there's someone like me recording the table without shame. So you know what? You're never alone in this world. There's always going to be someone who is shameless. And you know what? The world goes around and that's that. But anyways, I'm in the fiction area now. So this is a whole different area. But this is my reaction as I saw The Heart Principle by Helen Huang because I love Helen Huang and I cannot wait until she writes another book because I will be the first person to pre-order it. Don't you worry. But that is all for my Barnes & Noble trip. Just a little mini trip. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy. Check out the description for all my other links and I'll catch you on the flip side. Peace.